On Monday this week, Rwandan authorities announced that the Katuna border post would be open for movement to heavy trucks heading into Rwanda in what Kigali called a trial of its one-stop border infrastructure. However, two days after this announcement, Michael Seed, a clearing agent at the Katuna border, says trucks heading from Uganda to Rwanda have not been cleared to proceed on their journeys. Because of Rwanda not allowing goods, local goods from Uganda, we have managed to exit some two trucks of cassava and dried cassava going to Congo. According to this agent, only those heading to other countries through Rwanda have been allowed. Apart from those coming from Kenya, but the trucks from Uganda going to Rwanda, they have not yet come. I think they have not allowed the rules of Uganda to go to Rwanda over now. The town clerk of Katuna Town Council, Eric Sande, says the border closure has continued to have a toll on the revenue collected. We have lost a lot of revenue close to 150 million since it was closed in February. We used to collect around 300 million from local revenue, but as I talk now, we have not collected uh, more than 150 million. However, there are some sections that are happy about this short-term opening of the Uganda Rwanda border. <laughs> The Rwanda-Uganda border crisis all started on the 27th February 2019 when Rwanda closed its borders with Uganda in Katuna and Chanika and Kabare and Kisoro districts respectively.